The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Japan, weighing in at 200 and... And his opponent from Tokyo, Japan, weighing in... Guys, we have a superstar that is molded to be the next big thing. While he might be molded, he can still use a little refining. If he can harness that potential, we're looking at the next big thing. Sure, a little rough around the edges, Corey, but there's something that comes with time and experience. Yeah, but he has his work cut out for him against a superstar who is always prepared for competition, always focused and ready to go out there and compete. That preparation is the type of thing that elevates a superstar, Saxton. to the floor, here he comes. He's one step ahead there. Oh, the knee drop connects. Basement oh. drop kick. Ace first off the knee. Well scattered reversal there. Look at the knees, just unloading knees to the body. taking their lumps at this point. Their opponent is not messing around. Oh, he retaliates. Into the hammerlock. Oh, boy. back suplex. Going for the home run. Oh, shot. Glad I put my money on that guy tonight. Two. He caps out somehow. He's taking some serious hurt, but 
but somehow he's still in this. I think he managed that kick out on pure instinct alone. A new strategy is needed right about now if that couldn't end things. Answering back. Pinning down their opponent's arm. Dropping the knee for more punishment. Got their opponent all tied up. This is unique offense and painful as well.
Teeth. Knee drop. Textbook side headlock takeover. Tremendous pressure on the head and neck. Broken up with a fist to the face. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. Into the hammerlock. Oh boy. Back suplex. He's back into the ring. And here's another peek at some of the more memorable parts of the match. Here is your winner, O. Carter. You cannot say they didn't give it their all and then some to achieve this victory. The reward definitely seems greater than the risk right about now, but we'll see how they feel once they get back to the locker room and hit the showers.